Hey there on the, the Sal Cow playing VIP 6. There's gonna be a beep! See, because that's how you're supposed to probably pronounce it. It's actually probably more like beep. Uh, yeah, so that was Lightning Strike. Last time! Boy, howdy, last time. Wow, I still end with 9 line lives, though. Oh, there was things or something. I don't know, we're going to Cloud. So, I have a choice. I got this Cloud here to start World 6. So, there's that level right down there to start World 6, maybe. I'm going with whatever one's closest for now. Heaven and Hell! Dual 1, let's fight. You might just be able to resurrect defeated enemies by scrolling the screen with LRR. What does this imply? What are we going to do? The time limit is gigantic. Alright, well, we're in heaven here. Is it just an enemy bouncing level? I mean, I can do that. I can't. It's underneath this. Yeah, you can't see there at all what's going on. It's a pretty good star. Alright, but it looks to be a fairly vanilla, fairly existential kind of thing. You just do some enemy bop. Like, I like enemy bops. Enemy bops can be hard. But, okay, so this time, yeah, the scroll and scroll nearly as high. So, like, you. That is nutty, and I love it. Okay, all right, let's go. Muncher bounce. I didn't even need to bounce on one of them. Oh man, holding on here. Okay, so here we're gonna go on Bayou Billy. Here we go. That's what that game is all about. Don't trust me, you can trust me. Uh, okay, so I guess I'm gonna wait for the fire so I can do this. I like how there's two of them, because uh, you know that the second launcher is gonna fire directly after the first. So by putting them like that, you can kinda... I don't, like, I'm assuming if there's coins, okay. Like, I saw the money, so I was like, okay, I'm gonna trust you, VIP6, the video game. And, uh, yeah, trusting paid off. Again, like, I'm gonna assume that I wanna align with the money, although I went way earlier there, to be perfectly fair. Could be things here. There could be things on this pipe. I don't know. Oh, there's a midpoint. Oh, really? Ooh, do I have a choice or am I now like now I have to go the hell route because I didn't continue without the midpoint? Oh, this might be worth exploring. Anyways, there's a lot of enemies you may have noticed. Oh, that's a mistake. Yeah, you need to bounce on that guy. And here you cannot scroll the screen with L and R, but you do have given a cape, so whatevs, man. Check out that guy. Uh, that's right. Oh, violence. Alright, there's lava, because you can't have hell without lava. Oh, wait, but we're gonna do a whole bunch of jumble jumps. Here we go. Welcome to Jungle's Gym. Eat some fried potatoes. Maybe we will add a grapefruit to your head. Oh, that's not added value. That's added pain. So strictly speaking, the cave does make this slightly harder by a factor of I want to hold my jump all the time. That cannot possibly be worth it. No, I, uh... Maybe you kick it down there and that's how you realize that there's land. Okay. I get it. Oh, it's not land. You just kick it out there and realize that nothing matters in the world. Oh, uh, okay. Uh, hey, ho. Oh. Long cat, pretty great. Hanging out in the interstate. Watch out about the traffic. Don't want to get hurt. Oh, there's a bar down here. It's not fun. Kuma. Kumbaya. He likes to roar and swat at flies. Okay, and here I'm just going straight back to heaven without really thinking about it. Heaven or hell, give up. There's, there's the last Dagadon. Where's the remaining da- Oh, I couldn't fly. Wait, you, flies removed? How arbitrary. You can't fl Oh no, you can't fly. Okay, I guess I just messed it up. No, flying is hard. What's up with this level? It's so- I don't want to say easy. Because it's not like free, but compared to what we've just been, this is a nice relaxatron that does not go at all where I thought. Oh, now we're going to hell, and this. And it combines back here? Oh, that is some interesting s s 
stage construction. I want to... Okay, I'm just gonna check something right quick. I want to check beyond the the heaven pipe. That's where the last Dagadon is. Like, I'm just genuinely curious. Whoops. Alright, so beyond here. Yeah! Here's the Dagadon I didn't get. And an extra moon in the end. So, now we know. Circuitry have been properly looped. So, and here's where all the paths meet back up. Here's now the ultra-saturated cave. We get thread and be turned into a convenience store, as you do. But now all the paths had it open to end up here at the Man Bong Guang. Please tell me, what is the Man Bong Guang? Level name refers to a North Korean cargo and passenger ship line known as the Man Guang Gong Bong. <laughs> Dong. Gong Long. Sorry, it's repeating sounds. I can't help that. In Japan, it's mainly known for being the only ferry line that operates between Japan and North Korea until a permanent entry ban on all North Korean vessels was imposed in Japan in 2006. Uh, there have also been rumors of it uh, having been used for smuggling and adoptions. Most, uh, both ships with the name are still afloat at the time of this writing, which is 2020. Like, April-ish? May-ish? Somewhere around that. Uh, one exit, it's a yellow level in the water. It's a Korean ship. We had Korean bridge before in early bit. Uh, this one's a ghost house. There's a ghost. It's gonna be a ghost house level, but with war. And it's gonna- oh, the scroll too! Get the Dagadon, just don't make a big thing about it. That's kind of my, my, my situation here. Butter bridge. Alright. But my bridge, this is what I'll never say, until now- Oh, it's rising tide, too. Okay. We got a whole bunch of strange dynamic happenings here. There we go. Jump off. Bounce on our ghost. He's so happy to be here. Eerie surprise- I mean, that's my fault. That's me and my weird tendency- uh, Now I'm panicking and just playing like a fool. But me and my weird tendency- you See, this is why I want to realign the blocks that give you power. Oh. Okay, so <laughs> tied on one end. Oh, jeez, hell, dude. Okay, this got compact suddenly. Here, yeah, just veer off completely on the side. That's exactly what. Hi, yeah, of course, it's a cannon. This level's built on that principle. All right, hang out here. Then you can go here. Uh huh. So it's spike on one end, water on the other. Like, so it's not layer. Well, it is layer two. It's not layer three tied. Just a layer two with transparent water on it. That's sharing, uh, sharing its lot with a spike ceiling. Cohabitation is the future. All right. Well, it's pretty much the present. <laughs> what you got? Money, money. Hey, okay, another power up. Yeah, keep it going. That is what I like about you. Yeah, you find that you. Why did I jump there? I could have just walked. I just got myself hurt there for no. Oh, is this an air regenerator now? Could be. Hi. He just he just sneaked in. He said hi, and I said hi too with my life. Super Mario Super Show. So I know World 5 is supposed to get real hard. Uh, I've known this before I started World 5. People all over the internet were like, Oh, cow, World 5, there's a lot of rank 5 levels there, and rank 5 is the highest, like, difficulty rank. I don't know anything about World 6. World 6 is a completely unknown. I, like... You are to expect things to get harder in a further level. But I'm not taking that for granted. Wow, that's... Gameplay of a thousand warriors. <laughs> Truly, I have mastered the reflexes necessary for advanced Mario playing. Does this mean anything? Is this a secret pipe? I... no, it's just there. Cause, well, I... well, looks like a cool place to put money. I don't know. Placing money is hard. Oh shoot, I'm alive. Yeah, there's gonna be a mushroom here. Not here. Here. Alright. There's 
ghosts all around me, though. All right, here's a place where I got hurt in a dumb way. I remember that. Just, yeah, just, you can just do that. You don't need to jump. You can jump if you want, but you don't need to. Like, that's that's the key here. That you don't need to. Alright, so a little, a little special guy, yeah. So they want, they want to say hello. Got their little paws up. And they're like, hey, I'm gonna paw you up. I'm like, what does that even mean? Um... Auto scroller is slowing down here. I don't even know if it's supposed to slow down or if it's just the sprites. Shoot. I want my big. And I want to get out. <laughs> I managed to do both. Pretty happy with this. I'm gonna turn here in case there's a ghost. There can be. Ghost is scary. There's the last Agadon. Uh, well, I got her in a dumb way. You know what? Let's just... Did it. I got it. I got one up. That's clearly why I want all the Nagadons. It's for the precious resource, which is lives. So either... Okay, so they put all the coins on one half. Like, <laughs> some authors get it that it's more fun this way, but others are like, um, I don't, I'm not here for you to have fun, my friend. Alright, so, we're still in the water. In case you couldn't tell, this is Boone swimming. It has very specific animations and physics, and it makes a sound effect. Oh, here there's there's no pit anymore, so you gotta hurry up. Okay, so yeah, like, the, the spikes, they're just, like, a constant memory of times most foul. But also, they kind of obscure uh, the ground a little bit. So, you gotta pay, whoa, special attention. You know, like, where, where is it going to be okay for you to keep going down? Like, where are governmently sanctioned area that are okay for dancing? It's the kind of thing that, oh boy. Like, often, like, there's no signs or anything, right? Like, you just have to know. Or, you just have to know someone who knows, who's willing to tell you. Now, with the internet nowadays, that kind of knowledge isn't nearly as hard to attain as it used to be. That part's real mean. That part's a meaner. Wow. Okay. Hey, hey, look at that. I got my little respawn room here. I got money. Really? Respawn moon with money? That's just weird. Is is it just weird? I think that's weird. There's no denying that. Uh, well, yeah. This is real hard. It's just that, you know, also you're small. Back to where I got... No, it's the... It's, I knew it. Okay. Okay. I knew they would... Well, how do you get past here? I don't know. And this is where I died, I think. And then I hesitated too much and I died from that. Ah, dude. Uh, ghost. Uh, I got gun, gun through my face. Ah, the spikes that you can't even see. Nah, I, I, no. Yeah, I'm, uh, this is just a very dull, sleepy segment that I can barely pay attention to, and which is why I think I'm dying a lot. It's because I'm just kind of nodding along. <laughs> this is not the best that the series has offered. I mean, it's not bad. It, the problem is not that it's bad. The problem is that it's... Kind of there. It's not very interesting, and it's not very stimulating. I feel like, as the player, like you just kind of, just kind of going through the motions of sinky water. This guy. Okay, no. Okay. There's an extra power up here, by the way. All right. So down from laser cat. Got it. Laser. Well, that's gonna help a lot. Because that is an extra hit, and you get another hit here. So I'm thinking... There might actually be, like, a ton of extra hit throughout, like, the entire level that I just don't know about. Hey, it's this place that killed me first time. Well, it would've killed me this third time. It is right at the end, too! I was right! I didn't want to be right! 
Okay, time's not great, and I just did that like a dumb. Oh boy, yeah, I don't know. How I oh, but you got me an extra mushroom here. Hopefully, I won't squander. Yeah, kind of. Ah! Okay. How close does Tennyson get to here? I, oh, sh I'm no. I I. Mm. Oh, dude, I I was not looking up there. I just wasn't. Yeah. Okay. Well. No. Ah, I didn't mean to swim up there, but I mean, once you get going, you can't stop. And the timer or gear that's slow. It's in general. Fantastic playing there, Alcal. You're. You are the best. Uh, capital space between the and best. Tell about a lot of different. Whatever. Oh, well, that's real unfortunate. Well, yep. Yeah. Uh. Shoot, I might have killed myself there. Uh. Tunnel Mac. Whatever. I don't care. I'm bored. That's what's making me do stupid moves. I am, like, very bored. Boredom is the last thing you want to invoke when making a level in a game. Uh, unless you're making a game about boredom, but that's not the vibe I'm getting here. I, everything is just very clinical. It's go here, do the very same thing at the very same place always, and the same thing's always going to be the same every time. It is very boring. It's very clinical. It is rot memorization. It is the worst aspect of an auto scroller that you can have. Except only that, it feels like. You know, the first time you play it, there's a certain aspect of discovery before you figure out the, the patterns and all that. But once you did, you welcome to a world of complete stagnation where I keep getting hit in dumb ways because I just do not care. Like, it's just... I... I... It's hard to explain. The first half was fine. Like, yeah, it was also an auto scroller, but it was very dynamic. I'm, I'm dead. Because I did that wrong, I'm, I'm not gonna make it through that weird thing where, like, everything in the universe is present. Oh, hey, I made it through it. <laughs> It's like I went through it a few times or something. Alright, here I just need to not die. I also don't have a lot of time. By design, because again, like it's an older scroller. It will always take the same amount of time. time uh, am I just in an unavoidable situation? I sure am. Wow. I have... Uh... Oh boy! I love having my difficulty being a generator. I would probably be done by now if I did play- right. First hit. Got in. Did that. Now they're doing the staircase thing. I think I got this mushroom. Probably gonna get hurt. I didn't. I'm surprised. Alright. I'm good here. You can do that. Just waiting for the wire rise. Yeah, the generator slightly aims for you. It is very much using your location to help it locate it. You know what? That's fine. Just hit him here and I'm done. I don't have to play this level ever again. I'm not gonna even let that guy go right through me. He's a ghost. He can't touch me. He's a ghost. He's dead. I'm not dead. The dead and the undead can't touch. Unalive, the alive and unalive video games. I don't know. Like, I want to say it's not bad. Like, there's clever setups. It's well constructed. There's no bug. Every There's a theme. There's a flow. But I got bored. How do you define the quality of a level? 